Hello. Um, it's been a couple days before I, uh, since I've made a YouTube video, so I was thinking that I would just um, interview myself for a little bit, let you guys know what was going on, just to do something and be a little bit active on my YouTube page. I do have some ideas uh, for videos coming very, very soon, possibly Sunday. Um, it's a surprise, and then I have I have other projects too that are, I'm working on. But anyways, right now I uh, I've been I had a kidney infection a week ago. I guess I still have it now, but um, I was really really sick. It was awful. I had horrible fevers and. Vomiting, nausea, lower abdominal pain on the left side. I had no idea um, that it was kidney infection. Let it go for quite quite a while, a few days, because I'm afraid of hospitals and I hate doctors. And I um, went this lamp to work. And I went to the emergency room. They said it was a after a big fucking deal of bullshit and CAT scans and whatever else, um, they determined that it was a kidney infection, so I got on antibiotics, and I, uh, I'm still on the antibiotics, Cit Citro, I think is the name of it, and I thought that my life would be over without being able to drink every night, and I haven't been drunk since Tomorrow will be two weeks, and uh, that's really that's really strange. It should be really scary to somebody who goes out and drinks as often as I do. I pretty much drink every night, and when I was really sick, I didn't feel like drinking. And then after I went to the emergency room, I couldn't. I can't drink on antibiotics. It's like a big rule. You're not allowed to drink on antibiotics. So. I haven't been drinking, but the other night, well, you know, a while ago, I went out to a bar, and, like, I went out with my friends, and I went out to a metal show, actually, and, and didn't drink, you know, just had water all night, pretty much, took it, took it pretty easy, and I still had a great time, and I still, like, thrashed around and like, you know, head banging and dancing and stuff like that. And having fun. Having sober fun. You know, all my friends are drunk and stuff, but I don't feel like I, like, don't fit in or anything. Like, I still am really excited and crazy and having fun. And it was really cool to feel that way. To be totally sober and still be like, stupid fun, you know, like, all the plus things of alcohol except without, like, feeling dizzy and, like, like, falling over or going to sleep or something. So, so I was really shocked that I dealt with that so well and then, and I've been finding other things to do in this town other than go out to a bar and get wasted every night, which is pretty awesome, but... Not to mention the money I've been saving, and, you know, the random strangers I'm not hooking up with, that's good, too. I went out last night, again. I mean, I hung out at a bar, and then I went to a dance club, and I didn't need to drink. Uh, I had a blast. I fucking was dancing, and, you know, being very social, and, you know, not drinking. It's really bizarre. It's pretty crazy. So, anyways, alcoholics out there, don't let it get to the point where you have a kidney infection and you have to stop drinking like me. Um, but maybe, yeah, maybe you should, uh, maybe you should get a kidney infection. Help me out. It fucking hurts real bad. That sucks. But you know what? They prescribe me Percocets and, like, Motrin. It was totally ridiculous. I'm, I, when I, even when I went in there, I was like, well, it doesn't hurt that bad right now. I just, you know, I have a fever or whatever. And they're, like, trying to give me all these painkillers and stuff. And I'm like, I don't... Nothing hurts. Like, leave me alone. And then... 
then they prescribed me Percocets, and I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm not, I'm not in any pain. Like, chill out. And so, you know, I have a, so, yeah, get a kidney infection. If you have a drinking problem, because I'll tell you what, you won't want to drink after that. And uh, then you'll realize how much fun you really are. And how much of a cool person you might be. And uh, how much you you don't need alcohol to feel good and have a good time. All you need is uh, cool friends. A good environment. And uh, you need to feel good about yourself. That's what I think. Anyways, anyways good luck. Alcoholics, I'm right here with you.